Who knows what will happen? I haven't a clue. No one knows what will happen next. It all depends on you. Can't see round the corner when I'm going round the bend. No one knows what will happen or if this madness will ever end. American heroes, true stories of the men who made America great. In the early 20th century, the U.S. Navy converted from coal power to oil fuel. In order to make sure that the Navy would always have enough fuel available, President William Howard Taft designated several oil-producing areas as naval oil reserves. That's right, I did it. Me, Taft, the fattest president there ever was. I got stuck in a bathtub once. Do you remember that? Mm. In 1921, President Warren G. Harding transferred control of several of these public lands to the Department of the Interior, then headed by one Albert B. Fall. Hey, Albert. Yes, Mr. President? You're going to be all right taking care of all these mm, lands. No. Yeah. Yeah, I'm okay. excited. I... Secretary Fall then leased the oil production rights to these properties to oil companies without competitive bidding mm. and under right, extremely Fred. favorable terms. Hey, there's flowers for you. Flowers, that's nice. <laughs> Pretty nice flowers, huh? The oil leases were entirely legal. The only quote-unquote crime he committed was accepting hundreds of thousands of dollars in gifts and money. <laughs> I am really happy to have all this money. Feels good. Yeah, I really feel like I deserve it. Albert Fall's American dream had come true. Oh, yeah. He had struck it rich and began to live a life of wealthy extravagance. Yippee. It was the life he deserved. Unfortunately, it would not last. A weird bird I bought. I have received a letter from one of my constituents telling about a secret land deal. I'm going to investigate. Soon, congressional investigations would discover the truth that Albert Fall had attempted to make a better life for himself, and for this, he was punished by petty men and their stupid rules. Why? Why? We're, We're jealous. jealous. Some say President Harding was poisoned by his own wife on account of his oh. rampant womanizing. Oh. Hey, uh, don't, don't tell my wife about this, okay? I'm thirsty. Some say he had a stroke. Others have suggested it may have been suicide. We may never know the truth, oh God, uh. but we do know oh. that he was a great man. Albert Fall was found guilty of conspiracy and bribery and spent one year in prison. But though they took away his freedom, they never took away his American dream. Money. Oh, what can we do? You can be Napoleon and I'll be a Waterloo. We'll 